Hey everyone, it's Alessio Rastani of LeadingTrader.com. In the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how you can get hold in your hand free silver from your bank by just uttering five words. Okay? You got that just by uttering five words. It's the five words that your bank does not want to hear. All right, so what you're going to do is go to your bank. In fact, I'm going to go to this bank you see right over there, Bank of America. You can also try with other banks too, like Capital One, whatever. Okay? And what you want to do next is I'm going to go and exchange this $50 bill. Okay, so you walk into your bank and you say, just basically these five words you got to remember, right here down there, which is, please exchange for pre-1965, or please exchange for half dollars, okay, any half dollars you might have, all right? So I'm going to go there, I'm going to exchange this for some half dollars, and I'll explain to you why in a few moments. All right, guys? See you in a few moments. All right, guys, great. So I managed to get about $20 worth. So I didn't get the whole $50 worth, but $20 worth of half dollars, as you can see in these brown little packages you see here, okay? So what we're gonna do now is see how much uh, of these we can get of pre-1965 half dollar coins. And here's why. Now, many people don't know this, but in fact, the half dollars, which look like this, let me just show you. Let's just open this for you, just wanna focus on this. Okay, so, okay, as you can see here, this is what they look like. I'm gonna put this here so you guys can see. Okay, so this is what they look like. Now what we're interested in is the half dollars that are before 1965, because those half dollars have 90% silver in them, okay? The ones between 65 and 1970 have about 40% silver, okay? So those are still good. So this, is actually, this one is 1976, uh, sorry, 1971, so not much useful to us. So what I'm gonna do is just have a look, see if there's anything here that is, you know, 1964, 1963, something like that, okay. Alright guys, so we went through the whole batch of the 20 coins, 20 half dollars, and the only half dollar I found here that's pre-1965 is one of them, basically, just one. So we struck lucky at least. Um, this, as you can see here, is a pre-1965, it's a 1964 half dollar, as you can see here, that's what it looks like. And as you can see, it says 1964 on it, okay. This this coin I'm holding my hand here is 90% silver, okay? So if you do get lucky, and as we saw here, just one out of the whole batch, you know, that's still pretty good. You got a 90% silver coin here in your hand and free. And with the rest of the coins, what you could actually do, all right, you just go back to your bank and just exchange them for real cash, and you know, it's real coins, okay? That's, that's perfectly fine, you can do that. So I struck lucky here with this bank here, uh, Bank of America, and uh, we can also try Capital One. Um, here's the state of Maryland. Depends which state you're in, so it's not going to work at every bank, every state. All right, guys. Let me know how you guys do, and hope it helps. Bye for now.